Hello everyone, just inside Dollarama. So they have Carnation, the trio pack here. Usually $5 at the grocery store, so that's not too bad. Looks like they have some new light bulbs. I think this is a big brand. Falls under like the Cuisinart Oneida line. This is kind of new. These are so cute. I just did a little table setting for Valentine's. I'll insert some footage of how I did a tablescape with some of the dishes too from Dollarama. Once in a while, you'll find the Oneida line of items, just random stuff here at Dollarama. So I'm not sure if I should buy these because I do like having a funnel and plastic kind of discolors depending on what you use. I actually need one of these. Mine has a little rusty spot, so for $1.25, this is pretty okay to replace. What else is here? I do notice that they keep putting out more frying pans and cookware. By the way, these are awesome in your craft room or in your bathroom as well. Oh my goodness. So I've been eyeing these on Amazon for the longest time, but they're like a full unit. But they're so pricey to have them shipped. So I'm really excited. Now there are two sizes here. So let me just share with you. There's the quart and then there's the sandwich. The sandwich is a little bit smaller. You can see that little gap in behind. So anyways, things to think about. Maybe there are even larger ones for the large, larger Ziploc bags. So this is a Cuisinart paper holder, but it isn't metal. It's just a plastic tube. Lots of different style caddies here. And also new toilet brush brushes these here are actually priced at ten dollars i don't want to lift it and knock it over but i've seen the tag underneath originally tagged at five, uh, ten dollars and i think they're selling for five and i'm wondering if these are any good these round containers or i'm not even sure exactly are fairly new i'm just not sure what you're storing in them and then these are all brand new containers they're very shallow, but just simple, slim lines, so easy to put things in and I guess store them. But they have a variety of colors and um, I think they're reasonably priced. Dollarama also has a great selection of larger storage bins, but some of them don't have tops. These became a viral hit. I personally don't like the look of them. I don't like the functionality, but they come with two. And if you're looking for them, they are still available on the shelf. Let me know, do you like the style of milk crate? It just reminds me of university days and it's a no for me. So the oil effect glasses are new, right? They keep I keep spotting new things here in the glassware, so I might be late, but I think that they're new. This is a cute mug. Also, they always have a great selection of bowls, and if you like mixing and matching, so much fun here. But I want to share with you, they have these heart bowls, and they also have heart plates that I've purchased a set of four. And I'll share with you a little clip at the end how I am thinking of doing some table settings. These are ceramic, they're cheese holders, and they're new. There's a different print on the top, but I feel like the bottom bowl is too small for my brie. I buy a really large brie, I think. Otherwise, it would be in the cart, but I think it will fit a standard size brie. I just love these jars. I think they're so nice. They're beautiful. Um, they're versatile. You can use them in your craft room, in the kitchen. I don't use them in my pantry for storage of things. I'm just afraid that they'll fall. But for lighter things like tea bags, hot chocolate, um, in the kitchen area, I, oh my gosh, how cute. You can even put hot chocolate or some sort of mix in here as a gift. These are very cute. Some of them are plain and then others have the markings. 
some of the new home decor slash garden items you'll spot here. And there's some random Valentine's Day decor as well. I think that this value, the, the other box is a better value, this one here. Lots of new baskets though. This would be a cute Easter basket. What do you think? They have these little mini baskets similar to the ones at Dollar Tree. I think they're actually smaller. The bunny is cute, but I prefer to give a basket that can be used throughout the year for other storage purposes. This is nice. I think they're new. I haven't seen them before. This is, it feels a little bit cheapy to me for the price on it. Sometimes there's nice quality things, you know, when you just touch them, you can feel the quality. I am not a painter by any means to give recommendation on watercolor paper, but I have to say that this was very good and worked for me for like the pages are nice and thick, the thickest I've ever spotted at a value price. I think I'm going to grab these because I like the white effect of this. I don't know. It's not quite glitter. It looks like snow shreds. I'm not sure how to explain that. Like ice, ice crystals, you know, like freezer burn. I don't know. I think I can play with it, though. I purchased a couple of these bags because I just think they are so pretty, the crystals. So there's white, like a clear, and then I don't know if you can see. There's blue back here, too. But these are like a diamond effect. They have like a shimmery holographic rainbow effect to them. So they're really nice. What else is here that I... Are these new? They have lots of new storage boxes as well. This is made by Barbasol, which is a brand name. It looks like a nice little kit. All the things are on the outside and then you just put them on the inside. These are newer. They've been out for a few weeks now. And they look like they're stackable. There's a variety of different colors. Does anyone have a favorite perfume that they've purchased at Dollarama? They have lots of facial things as well, like rollers. And they have these new little kits that I spotted actually not too long ago. They're brand new. They're a makeup remover set. And I just think they're so nice to put in as part of a gift basket. I don't know if it's just me, but I love when there are empty pegs because I usually know that means something new is coming to fill the space. These are made by Olivia Rose. I'm not familiar with the brand, but there's some Nivea here, Aveeno. Look at this. Live Clean, more Nivea, tons of brand name finds here. So you should take a look at your local Dollarama if you are in search of any toiletries. Make sure you do some price digging though because sometimes you will find that other places um, might find, uh, you might find it on sale. Unfortunately, Dollarama doesn't put sales on their toiletries. Shall I go down the Easter aisle first or the Valentine's? I should have probably gone to Valentine's, but let me just share with you since I'm here already. They have these cute little... Oh, I thought it was salt and pepper shaker, but it's actually just a whole egg holder. They're cute. I wonder what else you could use. I mean, they look cute on a tiered tray. I love these. I mean, I can make these with the Cricut machine, but that would... For the price, this is pretty convenient. I'm just thinking of how I can incorporate it into my paper crafts. These are really cute, too, because they look like little egg carton. Uh, no milk curtains with the window but the colors are not vibrant enough for me i wish that the ink was a little brighter these are cute too oh my gosh with the little chick pom-pom on the top see the ink is just not that vibrant or am i just being super picky These are a three piece. Oh, look at this. Already done for you with the little decal on it. All wood. And they have the foam. Little diamonds. 
it looks like they're still putting things out for easter so this is just the beginning probably last year's stuff no because some of this is new i know some of you make these look like real chocolate bunnies and put them on display they have easter bags i don't really remember what they had last year so these might be the same prints or i remember seeing these and some of the reusable stuff oh my gosh these would be perfect as nail stickers nail decals and then just a nice coat of clear gel They've started putting out some of the Easter treats as well. So you've got some Lindt mini eggs, Kinder, the little Lindor or Lindt bunny. So this Dollarama actually has like two sections of Valentine's Day things. I've never seen that happen before. They have these beautiful kind of mug, clear mugs. They also have these with the 3D effect, which is why I love this pink mug. I just don't need any more. And I'm kind of fussy about my handle. Anyone else like that with their mugs? You just need to be able to have a good handle. And lots of towels here, some candles. Looks like everything is picked through over here. But I will share with you a bunch of other goodies. These are cute. And some stores have things on end caps throughout their stores. So it's kind of like a hunt for the Valentine Day decor. It's interesting. Maybe they're just still organizing themselves i'm not sure because valentine's is just a couple weeks away beautiful bag selection though i have to say some stores have a better selection than others lots of foam if you're a bohemian rhapsody movie fan or rocket man these books are i guess coffee table books so I just had to share with you because usually I don't really film a lot of the toy section unless I really see some great name brands. And look at this, Spider, it's Spidey from the Spider-Verse, like the animated, well, I think a lot of them are, but the movie that was in theaters was animated. It was like, uh, yeah, there were no hum there were no human actors. It was just animation. Super cute. Little figurines here. So if you have a Spider-Man lover. These plushies are massive. Now, I don't know what story it's from. It reminded me of, there were movies back when I was a kid. And I think it, Land Before Time, Littlefoot. I don't know if you remember them. Oh my gosh. One of my favorite, why I loved, I think I ended up loving the story of dinosaurs so much. But uh, they did such a great job with those cartoons. Some card games here. I had really good luck with their New Year's balloon kit that now I'm like, oh, maybe I should look for birthday kits, etc. There are some banners. Oh my goodness. How big are these? They look so cute. I just don't know how tall they are. These are going to sell so fast. Let's see, here's some more of those mugs. And there's two prints, so again, they have the solid just hearts and then they have the one without. These are cute too. Oh my gosh. Yeah, but I don't like the handle. See, I'm so picky. Oh, check this out. These are the heart bowls. They're fully stocked here. I don't even want to touch them because they're going to just topple on me. These are going to sell. They're not very heavy, but you can spray paint them or acrylic paint them and change them to suit your decor. These are so stinking cute. Now, would they look nice on that tear tray? I don't know. Let's take a look. It's too big, I think. I'm not sure the size, but I feel like it might be too big. Maybe somebody who's built the tear tray can let us know if these fit. These are a little bit smaller. Or no, are they? Yeah, they are a little bit smaller, but not by much. But they do have the little gnomes if you like them. They would look cute on the tear tray for sure. Like how sweet are they? What else is here? Beautiful, already done for you. Painted with a little pink. The other one has a little red. So nice. And then they have massive. Oh, these are like 3D. They pop like a 
you know, the, I don't know what they're called. There's a name for those types of banners. This is beautiful. What a nice little pick. Lots of Valentine's Day cards. I know you can use them in your paper crafts and stuff like that too. So sometimes it's nice to see them. These are, they come with a little gem or figure beautiful boxes but I find them a little pricey Dollar Tree is a little more reasonable with their red boxes some more bags going along quickly these are cute perfect for a little gift card or a small gift lots of plastic treat bags and paper bags as well and craft kits okay these cute as well but I'm gonna have to grab some of these there's some gem hearts and wood hearts and stickers. Well, you know me and stickers. If you've been following me over the years, I have a thing with stickers. Okay, these are beautiful. I have to grab them because Michael's had them and they were a lot pricier. And I might grab another sheet of these just for backup. You can never have enough backups because once you use one sticker, you need a replacement in case you need another one of those stickers, right? Here's a little table setting with the bowl and the plate and even the shallow bowl and the gold spoon from Dollarama. I thought I'd just share with you. Oh, and also they have the towels as well in the kitchen area. I hope that this inspires you to do a little setup for yourself at home. And until next time, everyone, thank you so very much for watching. Bye for now. One another with the feeling past, would you find out with me if it all starts to crumble? We'll search the pieces. to say goodbye